Fools! One million dollars once! Hi, I'm Mike Fredericks, Department Head for the Rare Lamp and Glass Division here at James D. Julia. Thanks for visiting us. Once again, we've assembled a fine assortment of rare art glass and antique lighting for your review. If you have any questions about specific items you're about to see, please contact us. We'd be happy to help you. Lot 1535 is a Dom Cameo and Marta Laid vase. This Dom vase has a bulbous body with a long slender neck and is decorated with enameled green Cameo leaves and stems ascending from the foot with pink cameo lily of the valley flowers hanging from the stems. Green cameo flowers also extend up the neck and all set against a purple shading to cream colored fully martellade background. This vase is signed on the underside and engraved with the gilded signature of Dom Nancy and the cross of Lorraine measuring nine and seven eighths inches tall. This vase is estimated at seven to ten thousand dollars. Lot 1533 is a Dom Nancy mold blown vase. This 17 and a quarter inch tall Dom Nancy mold blown vase has mottled green and dark brown trees, branches and leaves surrounding the entire vase. The mold blown decoration set against a fiery sky of mottled orange and yellow glass. The foliage at the bottom of the vase in between the trees has been wheel carved. It is signed in the polished panel with an engraved Dom Nancy and cross of Lorraine and is estimated at $8,000 to $10,000. Lot 1459 is a Galley Mold Blown Fuchsia Floral Vase. The Galley Mold Blown Vase has red and pink fuchsia flowers descending from the neck against a shaded cream and yellow frosted background. The vase also has a slightly opalescent interior to the mouth and is signed on the side in Cameo Galley. The vase measures 11 and 3 quarter inches tall and is estimated at nine to $12,000. Lot 1619 is one of 10 items being offered in the sale from the Susan and Roy Bitten collection of Schneider Art Glass, perhaps one of the finest groupings of Schneider Art Glass ever assembled. This lot is a Levere Francais lamp in the Calenco pattern with large stylized leaves and flowers in mottled brown and white set against a richly mottled orange background. The top and bottom of the shade and top of the foot are further decorated with a cameo honeycomb pattern. This lamp, measuring 28 inches tall, is estimated at three to four thousand dollars. Lot 1653 is a Rene Lalique Perusha's vase. This Lalique vase in the Perusha's pattern depicts pairs of parakeets resting on branches with flowers and leaves surrounding them. The vase is done in a very desirable rich blue glass with remnants of a white patination still remaining. This lamp measures 10 inches tall and is offered at $26,000 to $30,000. Lot 1366 is a Wedgwood Fairyland Luster Imps on a Bridge vase from the private collection of Betty and Leonard Assad of Florida. Betty was one of the premier dealers and collectors of the Wedgwood Fairyland genre. This Wedgwood Fairyland Luster vase is decorated with Imps on the Bridge pattern in a very rare cup combination, having green Imps on the Bridge, a purple fairy with white wings, a purple rock bird all against a mottled blue and purple background. This vase measures 11 and a quarter inches tall and is a wonderful example. This vase is estimated at $15,000 to $17,500. Lot 1408 is a phenomenal web rock crystal cameo vase. This rare web rock crystal cameo vase has all over cameo decoration of flowers in various stages of bloom, some with padded green and white flowers, some with padded red petals while others are carved over internal color decoration adding to the three-dimensional effect. The neck of the vase is carved with a garden trellis with butterflies in flight between the rungs of the trellis. The vase is also finished with a cased white interior measuring 14 inches tall. This excellent example is estimated at 60 to $80,000.